guys, it's Becca Boo here. Welcome to my channel. Sorry I sound really nasally. I'm getting over a cold. It took me so long to film today. I was sneezing, I was blowing my nose, coughing, all that. Today's video I filmed with the Violet Voss hashtag palette and it is so pretty. I love these orangey and purpley tones. It really reminds me of the Huda Beauty Desert Dust palette, just like the whole vibe of the palette. But this palette is launching the day after Christmas, December 26th, for $45. The Violet Voss eyeshadows are amazing. They're super buttery, super pigmented, easy to blend. I loved working with it. And I love the names of this. Like, Lit, Low Key, FOMO, Petty AF. And then, like, Goat. I have no idea what that means. I should probably look it up. If you guys know, let me know down below. And then, Savage. Yes. They should definitely have one that says, yes. <laughs> If you want to see how I got this look, then please keep on watching. To start off this look, I'm applying the Maybelline Fit Me Concealer to my eyelid as my eyeshadow base. Just blending that out with a blending sponge. And before I set it, I'm going to be taking some of the um, Nika Forever Flash Palette. Sorry, I don't have a product shot of it. But I'm just placing that in my crease and blending it out. And then once I have it nice and blended, I'm going to set that with a translucent powder. Now going into the Violet Boss hashtag palette, I'm taking Savage on a sugar pill blending brush and adding this to my crease, upper brow bone area as my transition shade. Then I'm just going to take this bone color called Fresh and run this along the brow bone to make sure it's blended. Now I'm taking Goals and adding this directly to my crease. Now I'm taking TBT, which is probably my favorite color ever in this palette, and adding this to my crease with the MAC 239, and then going in and blending with the brush I just used for the last color. Once I have it nice and blended out, I'm gonna go in and cut my crease in sort of a half circle shape. So for that, I'm using the Tarte Cheap Tape Concealer, probably my favorite thing to cut the crease with, as of right now anyway. So I'm just perfecting that, and then I'm going to blend that into the skin. Then I'm gonna take the shade Petty AF and add this to the inner third of my lid and then I'm going to add it to the outer third of my lid as well. Next I'm gonna take the shade Living and add this right next to where I just placed the last shade, so slightly more in on the inner third and then the same on the outer third, you know what I mean? And then picking up the previous brush to make sure that they are blending together. Now I'm gonna pick up the shade FOMO and I'm gonna place this on the center of my eyelid. Then again, I'm going to be picking up the other previous brushes and make sure that all of the colors blend seamlessly together. Next, I'm going to take TBT again and I'm going to run this along my lower lash line. And then I will be blending that out with, I believe, Savage. We're just going in with the same shades that I used on the crease, but just blending and spooking out the lower lash line going to take FOMO again and place this on the inner third of my lower lash line 
and then I'm going to take Petty AF again and add this to the outer third of my lower lash line. And then I'm going to take Living and add that to the center. And then of course blending them all together. To finish off the look, I'm popping on House of Lashes Allura Light Lashes and this is the finished eye look. Alright, so this is the completed look. I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial. Let me know down below if you're going to be picking up this palette. On my lips, I'm wearing the Sugar Pill Anti-Socialite Liquid Lipstick. This is like one of their newest colors. And then I put on the MAC Cosmetics Grand Illusion Liquid Lip Color in Gilded Age because I wanted it to be like kind of coppery to tie everything together. Also, I love these so much. You've seen them in um, a few of my other videos. I really love them. Like I never liked gloss before, but I love these. It's so weird. All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. I'll see you in my next video. Please like and subscribe. Bye, guys.